first of all, the Barzakh life is a life which is a barrier, which has a barrier between this world that we live in and a world that is unexplainable to us. You can't understand it. It is a life of a certain type with its own reality. And it is nothing like this world. And it is not the here after the day of judgment, nor is it this world. It is somewhere in between. Allah says in the Quran, بَيْنَهُمَا بَرْزَخُ لَا يَبْغِيَانِ About the two oceans that meet in this life. It says between them there is a barrier. The two seas do not mix. So this, this we use the word barzakh. And the same word is used for that life after here, before the day of judgment. Allah says in the Quran, and behind them, after them, meaning after you die, there is a barzakh world. Until the day you are resurrected. This points out to us that there is a life barrier that does not mix with this life and this world that you're living. You can't mix. You don't know what's happening to them. They don't know what's happening to you. And you cannot understand them. When you are dead, you understand what's happened there. It's a barzakh, a barrier between this life and the next. The, when you're dead before the day of resurrection. This Barzakh world, my dear brothers and sisters in Islam, as soon as you die, the soul begins to experience the Barzakh world. If you want me to give you a slight example, if you want to get it closer to your minds, in a very slight example, it's not exactly like that, consider dreams when you're asleep. Your body is in the room. And everyone can see your body, witness your body, touch your body. But your soul is doing something different. Seeing something different. Hearing something different. Isn't that right? It's in a different place. Don't even know where you are sometimes. But your body is there. To the living person, the person who is awake, all I can tell you is, I see a body that's sleeping. <coughs> but you're in a whole different world. Some people are sleeping, they don't even know that they're sleeping. They think it's reality. And some people know that they're sleeping when they're dreaming. Have you ever experienced that? You know you're asleep. So the Barzakh world is similar to when your soul goes out when you're asleep. Similar. You don't require oxygen. Have you ever seen yourself in your dream underwater? The soul doesn't need to survive on what you see your body survives. The body survives on food and oxygen, but the soul doesn't. So if you can understand dreams, you can understand the barzakh. As for me, I don't think anybody understands the phenomena of dreams and the way the soul comes out when you're asleep. And similarly, we cannot comprehend the barzakh world. This barzakh world, my dear brothers and sisters, is a temporary station between here and the hereafter, the day of judgment. In this temporary barzakh world, a person is able to find out if they are going to heaven or hell. 